This movie is stacked and I cannot wait to see it. How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about Russell Crowe and his role in the upcoming MCU Thor Love and Thunder. Apparently it was in the title all along because Russell Crowe is playing nobody other than Zeus, the god of thunder? Yeah, there will be two god of thunders in the upcoming Thor Love and Thunder. Who would have thought? This is quite the bombshell because there's other Olympians that have become part of the MCU, like Hercules, for example, that was once upon a time an Avenger, although it was just one time that he was an Avenger, but nonetheless, he was an Avenger. And it's kind of interesting to see here because Zeus and Odin, per MCU lore, um, has fought each other before thousands of years ago for MCU lore. So it's kind of interesting to see because as well, Zeus and Thor have fought side by side in the comics. So what exactly Russell Crowe's role will be here? I'm not quite too sure, but it, just thinking about Hemsworth, Crowe and Christian Bale will to be playing the God Butcher. So is that good news for Rosa Crow? Maybe not, or who knows? Uh, we don't know yet, we don't know much of anything about Thor, Love and Thunder, except some of the cast. But the cast is amazing so far. Uh, just by adding Christian Bale and Russell Crowe, it just elevates everybody up a little bit. Um, so what, what do you think Russell Crowe's role overall will be? you think he's going to be an ally? Do you think he's going to be an enemy? Do you think he's going to be sort of in the middle? Uh, because there could be a lot, a lot to be done here. They can use a lot of different comic issues, uh, different story roles, and you know, there's even Reborn Zeus, which was the lead of the Immortals. I mean, he could maybe make cameos in the Immortals. He could be in the MCU for the long term, or he could just be in just that one movie and maybe serve as a martyr for the rest of the movie as far as, you know, trying to take down Christian Bale's character. Thor Love and Thunder has in its cast Melissa McCarthy, Chris Hemsworth, Christian Bale, Russell Crowe, Matt Damon, Chris Pratt, Natalie Portman, Sean Gunn, I mean, whew. This is looking like an amazing, amazing cast. Interesting to see how um, Chris Pratt is also going to play in this, what role he's gonna be playing more or less, but it it's kind of a given that this movie is gonna have a lot of action and a lot of funny moments. I absolutely loved how uh, Chris Hemsworth and Chris Pratt had scenes on, um, on the Avengers movie and the uh, Guards of the Galaxy, so really, really cool so far. I can't wait to see what's coming next. Down below, there'll be my latest video and my Marvel playlist. I have done tons of reactions towards other Marvel content, so there's plenty of stuff here for you to watch. Stay as long as you like, and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.